Do you remember the first song you ever made? Uh, yes, I do. I Can do. you tell me a little bit about it? Um, okay, so basically, I remember I had... Okay, so I was doing YouTube covers. I was like, I would have been like 12 or 13. I was doing YouTube covers, and I remember my mom looked online, like a studio for me to go and record in. And at the studio, the guy was like, okay, like, I'll just, like, do a song for you. Like, I don't know if you remember, but, like, back in the days, like, they used, I don't even know if they still do it, but they used to do, like, packages. Like, okay, like, it'd be, you know, $300, and we'll, like, give you a song, and then you can record the song and, like, stuff like that. So, like, my mom ended up doing the package, and they wrote a song for me. Like, I met with them, and the song was called Pop Princess. And I was too scared to say anything in that moment, but I hated the song. <laughs> And it doesn't sound like you. No, I hated the song so much. <laughs> and I remember I, when my mom was driving home, I just kept crying. I was like, I don't like the song. And um, I went home and I ended up writing my own song. And it was called Puppy Love. And mind you, I was like 12, 13 years old. And I went back and I recorded the song. So the first song I wrote myself was actually called Puppy Love. Um, yeah. But the first song I actually got that would have been mine was Pop Princess, which I didn't like. <laughs> okay, so Pop Princess, was that all done by those producers that own the studio? Yeah. Like, you didn't have any part of the, the beat making or the, the lyric writing mm -hmm. or the melody making? No. And, and Puppy Love, I did. Puppy Love, I remember the producer that was there was like, okay, you know what? Like, I'll just give her beats. And he gave me beats. And I went home and I wrote it. And I went back in and recorded. Can you tell me a little bit about like the inspiration behind Puppy Love? Um, I definitely had a crush on that boy. <laughs> it definitely stemmed from like a crush um, because the song was basically me talking about like the crush I had. Like it was just like some like middle school stuff. Like, oh, I like this boy. But do I really like him? Like, it was really just about me, like, running home from school, like, waiting to get his phone call or, like, his text <laughs> message. It was so, like, it was so, like, I mean, it was cute. But it literally was, like, what I would have been, like, going through at that time. Like, experiencing, like, my first crush at, like, 13 years old. 